Uh, I like the new defense. It it gives us a, a better chance, a new chance to just like fly around and play, play more free, and gives gives the defense a line more freedom to like move around and do the things that they want to do more. And where you're playing in particular, technically, what more can you do when you break it down? Um. Well, back in the three four, I would have to like worry about surfacing more, getting more more hands on with the guys. Now I can worry less about that and just play and like play more in the backfield. So mm-hmm. I, I like that. And what's your height and weight now, Malik? Uh, I'm six five, two seventy five. And when you got here, you were like two forty five, fifty. Two thirty. Two thirty. Maybe two twenty five. Okay. Um, just hang out home with some friends, worked out, basic stuff, you know. Tough coming back to. Yeah, real tough. Getting back in the swing of things, I, I should be, I should be back and ready, ready to go by by tomorrow when workout comes. Yeah, can you play both end and tackle, or are you definitely just doing the one tackle? Right now, I'm playing tackle, but I feel comfortable with playing end because as last year we played three and five, but right now they just had me playing a three technique. So how do you rate the D line so far through spring camp? You know, some new faces. I know Quentin is out. Um, Shaw just went down, but you and Roman, you know, what's jumping out about the group in your mind? We definitely have to get, get healthy. Once we get healthy, I feel as though we'll be a complete unit. Right now, we're we're trying to find ourselves. We're, we're moving in the right direction. We all have things to work on individually and as, as a group collectively. And what do you do well? Um, I feel as though I, I have good technique. Uh, I have good pad level at, at some point in time, good hand placement at some point in time, and I, I say I have a re- relentless pursuit to the ball. Like from last year to right now, what, what's the number one thing, I guess, fundamentally that you've improved on, that maybe something that you couldn't do a year ago that maybe you've made the most strides in? Just being stronger, um, taking on blocks better, you know, Having a better first step and better hand placement and striking, Coach Coach Wilt puts a lot of uh, emphasis on those two things. And stopping the run in the Big Ten after year one, you saw it. Maybe that contributed in part to your change. In yeah, that's three. that's really important. What did you experience year one in seeing that the Big Ten run game and how now you're changing. Um, I seen that you will get a lot of runs and it's. It's key to be able to stop the run. That's you have to do that to, in order in order to win games. So I think the four three will will help us more with that. What do, where do you want your weight to be come the fall? Come the fall, I want to be at least two eighty five. Okay. Who's the leader on the group on the D line right now? As of Who's right now, most chatty guy. Um, I would say we all we all have things to say when we're out there on the field. Like we don't have like. A, a person who 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 stands out the most as far as like being an outspoken leader. We all we're all out there to pick each other up. So who's the young guys coming up that caught your eye? Someone like a Kingsley started to show you anything? Uh Brett Calker, he's doing good. Kingsley, he's doing good. Um Ose, the new he's he's a new guy, but he I see improvements going coming along, so he should be he should be good.